the grandmothers maintain a relentless pace as they lead the pride from island to island on the trail of the buffalo. On a welcome patch of dry land, Fulani and her cousins take the rare opportunity to romp. A brief lapse in concentration that has serious consequences. Fulani becomes separated from the group. The pride, drawn by the distant sound of buffalo, presses on, unaware that Fulani is missing. Her yelps are muffled by the sounds of the swamp. And her mother's scent trail is lost in the water. Eventually, Falani's mother hears a faint cry. Neither mother nor cub is sure of direction, and their paths diverge in the swamp. Fulani is in real danger. Small cubs, separated from the protection of the pride for even a short time, are killed by hyenas, crocodiles or leopards, or simply succumb to cold and exhaustion. In the Okavango, more than half the cubs die before they're even 12 weeks old. Despite her frantic searching, Fulani's mother cannot find her lost cub. As dusk approaches, the rest of the pride stop trailing the buffalo and settle down to wait. Fulani's mother won't give up her search. Hours of darkness are the most dangerous for an unprotected lion cub, with many predators on the prowl. 